What up, folks? Welcome back to Ultra's Little Toys. I got a little uh, unboxing for you guys. Maybe a little, a little bit bigger than a little unboxing. There's a few things here. Four items in, in three boxes. All from Amazon. If you guys didn't know, um, this weekend, Amazon had a Bluefin Tamashii Nations uh, sale. So, it was an all-day sale on Saturday. 30% and above so it was pretty cool. Uh, I actually made two separate orders there. One I, item, I, you know, it was like last minute at the end. I was like, oh, I didn't even realize that was there, and I kind of want, and I really wanted that. Um, and the other stuff I picked up really early in the morning. Now I was gonna. It, I, there's actually something missing here. There was actually five uh, figures that I picked up. Um, but one thing, and I'm gonna let you know what it is right now. It is the SH Figure Arts uh, Batman, the Dark Knight Batman uh, figure that recently came out. Uh, that was uh, twenty nine bucks, I believe. I paid for that, or thirty one bucks. One of the two. Really great deal. Um, but it's been, I guess, it's back ordered right now. Uh, so it was supposed to come today. And I just got the the note, and I was waiting for that to come before I, I did this um, unboxing, but now it's not coming till Monday, it says, and I, I don't even know, because if they're waiting for their back order, it's all uh, on uh, Bluefin to get them their, their new stock. So I don't want to wait for that one, um, I'm, you know, like I'll probably just include that in another unboxing or I might just post it up on my Facebook page when it arrives or something. No big deal. You guys know that I, you know, I'm getting that at some point now. So, uh, you know, it'll be in the mix for reviews. So they, so two of these uh, boxes, well, let's just open one box first. Let's see what's in this one. Um, one of the smaller boxes. I ordered, now I, I do know this box, which they're using these Thursday night football boxes, which I hate because it's very hard to reuse. I mean, you can, but it's just, eh, bleh, I don't like that. <laughs> Too much branding, you know? I'm fine with like reusing uh, their regular boxes, but anywho. Uh, so I did order these things at the same time. Oh, this is. I am confused now because I don't know what's in this bigger box. That's very strange. Okay, so the stuff that's in this box right now, the smaller box, um, I thought was gonna be in the bigger box. Because <laughs> there's two items here, and is this box just one thing? It's very strange. First thing, the SH Figures Triple H. I did get the Rock and Stone Cold, and I did want to continue this line. Uh, and I've seen this guy a million times before at you know cons, and I really like them. Um, <laughs> not sure I do as much in person now, so we'll see when the time comes to review this. Uh, I'm not gonna open any of these guys right now. I just it's too much stuff here, um, so I don't <laughs> don't want to count my chickens before they hatch. And I did get Taker, Undertaker. So both, uh, Triple H was like, they were both like in a 30 buck range. So I think this one was a little more than this one, but uh, this is a bigger figure, you know, so. This one does, this actually does look better than the prototypes. So how about that? So I think uh, it's a reverse thing going on here <laughs> where one looked better than the other. Okay, so I'm gonna open up the, this big box now because there should only be one item in here, but why is this so... Unless it's a bigger box than I... I thought. Now, <laughs> I I missed this one, you know, as I was like looking to order stuff, uh, I was tagged in a post by Steven of Steven's Toy Reviews uh, on the super articulated... Uh, Kaiju Collectors Group and uh, on Facebook, <laughs> uh, just for those two guys. But then he had posted that this guy was here, and uh, he doesn't think too highly of this one. 
yeah, there's only one thing. Oh, it is a bigger box than I, I thought it is. Um, but I got it anyway because I've always wanted to check it out. And it's an SH Monster Arts that I actually don't have. It's the uh, Alien Big Chap. So it is a little bit of, bigger of a box, but not this big. <laughs> so I guess this came from a different facility. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I always want to check this out. So, again, I've heard bad things, but we'll give it my own opinion. We'll see. So, uh, yeah, I never picked up any of the aliens or predators from SH Monster Arts. Uh, I just, I, I don't think they should have been. SH Monster Arts. I guess, you know, when that line first started, it was, you know, they had a broader idea of what they wanted to do with with uh, this line. But I always just considered the line to be more for, like, straight up giant monsters. So, all right, so last thing here. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, and it's a bummer that all the figure didn't come. I just didn't, I didn't want to not open these boxes for that long, so... We'll see how it goes. Now this guy, this is a static figure. Oh, and it's a little, it's got some tape on it. And it's a Storm Collectibles, which Bluefin distributes as well. And it's the Storm Collectibles Bruce Lee. Um, but this is one of their static figures. Um, yeah. So this is an interesting one because it has two different heads. Uh, for it and it's got you know the regular Bruce Lee head and then it's got like one with like uh like a goatee which is yeah, it's you know rare to see Bruce Lee with a goatee but there you go some some pics of him with it there and I think that's pretty interesting so <laughs> funny enough this might be my first storm collectibles that I actually open on um, because it's a static figure I do like I don't know, if you notice, whenever I do get, like, little hauls and there's static figures in there, I, I kind of try to bang them out real quick reviews because they're so easy, and it's just, like, boom, out, out of the way, you know? So I try to do that for, for most of the static figures, um, just get them out of the way as quick as possible. So I probably will be reviewing this guy very soon. I don't know yet. I do want to... Get that Shin, that new Shin Godzilla that I opened up on my Mystery Box Day. If you didn't know what that Mystery Box Day was, it's a uh, exclusive Shin Godzilla second, third, and fourth form figure. So go check that out. Well, I'll post a link here <laughs> at the end. But yeah, so I'm kind of excited about this one. I, I missed it uh, during my initial search through all the products that were available. Um, because there was so many like little sub like pages of products. So yeah, this was one of the things that was on sale. Um, and I, I've seen this before in person there, and I think it looks really cool. So, okay, I'm, I'm done. Some aliens, some wrestlers, a Bruce Lee figure, not bad, and a Batman figure when it eventually comes. That one I'm really looking forward to. I was really excited that, that was on sale because it was one of the newer items uh, that they had that was price dropped. Along with Taker, Taker's pretty, pretty new as well. So they didn't price drop Kane. Hmm. So looking forward to getting Triple H, Kane, and The Undertaker all in one shot here. <laughs> but it didn't happen. What are you going to do? Um, I do have Amazon points getting ready to pop up any moment now. So I might, you know, grab the Kane uh, on a discount with that. We'll see. Um, haven't decided yet. I, st I has also have to, you know, complete that uh, rookie wave from the DC Multiverse. So I might get couple more though i don't know and we'll see we'll see how it goes but here's some stuff hope you dug it let me know what you're looking forward to did you guys uh jump on that sale if you did let me know what you got i'm kind of curious to see what everybody got there was a lot of dragon ball z uh available i was tempted by a couple of figures but i wanted to keep you know what i spent to a certain amount and as you see i already have four figures here and a fifth one so I spent a good amount anyway, even though these were all super discounted. Um, so there you go. Let me know what you got. So until next time, peace out, peeps.